Uh, talk about the rain coming our way. It's not much. It's just going to dampen the pavement, really. Uh, we have drizzle and areas of light rain. So you can see that here on Storm Tracker 4. And if we switch over to the weather reporting stations here to see which ones are actually reporting rain, you can see Flint, Howell, Lansing, and Jackson, right where you saw that radar return there on the uh, on the Storm Tracker 4. And to the east, it's basically still dry. So temperature wise, if you're just heading out the door right now, uh, maybe an early morning jog, it's mostly upper 30s across the area to near 40 degrees. It's a little bit cooler in the thumb, but you were the last to cloud over, so you cooled off the most. So broadening out the picture here, you can see that we have just this narrow, compact little area of weather crossing the Great Lakes. There's just a cold front coming across, and that front will cross the area by midday, and by this afternoon, there could be a lingering isolated lake effect rain shower in the thumb just coming coming down off of uh, perhaps Saginaw Bay. But other than that, we should start to see at least some breaks of sunshine, but it will become breezy this afternoon. So even with a high of 47, that's not bad like yesterday, but with you had sunshine and light wind. Today, it's going to feel cooler. All right, for your weekend, Saturday starts off with lots of sun, and we keep the sun well into the day, but clouds do increase later in the day. The Michigan State game is fine. You're in East Lansing with sunshine. The Michigan game starts off dry. Rain could approach before the end of the game. So this is going to be a real close call. So we're going to keep an eye on that one. Now see that warm front there to our south. That does come through. So temperatures will rise Saturday night. You're going to wake up to rain and warm temperatures Sunday morning. Then this front comes through and we're going to have temperatures falling through the 40s in the afternoon. And we could have 40 to 45 mile per hour wind gusts behind this cold front. So uh, there could be some wind issues come Sunday afternoon. But basically for today, 47 the high and becoming breezy this afternoon. And on the seven day forecast, you can see that we have the sunshine tomorrow, the showers Sunday morning with the wind in the afternoon. And then it looks like uh, 40s for most of next, next week, but most of next week is looking dry.